What's up? It's Rob from FLX with your Baby Maker production update of the week. We do have a live next week, October 27th at 2 p.m. PST. If you got any questions, join us live on air to ask away. We're going to start the update off this week with not your Facebook, but your Instagram photo. So if you have tagged at FLX.bike or use the hashtag FLXbike in your post, we're going to check those out now. Starting with Jason JLF Designs, Max Chilton with his custom painted, FLX bike, baby maker, e-bike. He got a custom made baby maker from Jason JLF Designs. It's absolutely beautiful, super cool at the racetrack. Enjoy. From Bio Naturista France, une petite balade parisienne. It looks like Paris. You see the Eiffel Tower in the back. Baby maker pro in matte black, beautiful. Enjoy the ride, great place to ride. From La Luna Brujilla in Beckenham Place Mansion. The sun worshiper doing some yoga next to a regular bike and tangerine baby maker. Enjoy. From Shun Yoshida, and this is in Japan. It's all in Japanese to me. I understand two of those words because they use Chinese characters, but uh, Sterling Baby Maker Pro, just beautiful and amazing place to ride there in Japan. Lots of bikes, very cool. All right, we're gonna start the global status update in the US with container C25 the CSCL Spring. That is due October 29th to the port of Long Beach. Now there's a lot of port congestion right now, record breaking port congestion. So we're hoping that will just smoothly get through, but it could be backed up for some days there. We will keep you updated. That has 58 baby makers, also touring packages and chargers in it and address confirmations for the touring kits will be sent this week. For Hawaii and Alaska, the last of the bikes have been sent a little mix up with Alaska, one of the bikes which was labeled very clearly for Alaska somehow made it to Hawaii. So we're working on that. Troy is trying to get that back to Alaska. So for the one folk in Alaska, sorry about that. The entire global shipping market is a little strange right now, but we are working through it. So that brings us to Europe, SP8 through SP11. Business as usual, virtually completely shipped for all those. There's a handful of those which I believe we're still waiting for a VAT payment. If you haven't taken care of it in a reasonable time frame, we've got to send those to the next person who has been waiting and it kind of boots you back to the end of the line. So please, if you received a letter on that, make sure it's taken care of so we can get you that bike in a timely manner. For the newer shipments, SP12, that was 143 baby makers. They went to distribution. The Swiss bikes have shipped, European bikes are shipping, UK bikes are shipping, all of those as the VAT is paid. Same thing with SP13, that is 87 baby makers. The Swiss bikes have shipped, the European bikes, those will be shipping very soon, and UK bikes, I believe, have been shipping. Again, all of those as VAT is paid, so please take care of that in a timely manner. Batteries and chargers, not only for the EU, UK, but around the world. If you ordered a spare battery, those are in progress. We're waiting on the delivery to our production partners in China, and then they will be distributed through the rest of the world from there. So we'll keep you posted on those. Now the final bikes for Europe and the UK, those came on the OOCL France in container 14. Enough components to build 227 bikes, which is all the remaining baby makers for Europe and UK. They are at Spanish Customs right now. We're waiting for those to clear customs, arrive at our production facility, be built into baby makers and ship out from there. So we're hoping for a speedy customs clearance. No word that it has cleared yet, but we will keep you posted as soon as it clears and moves on to the next step. Container 15 that came on the one Manchester that has touring kits and accessories, everything but those aforementioned batteries. That is being transferred to our Spanish distribution facility. From then the parts will ship out to their respective locations. So keep an eye out for that. Address confirmations for the touring packages will probably be sent this week. That is for Europe and UK. A few more Instagram photos for you from Gao 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 in Japan, my new ride. Again, it's all Japanese to me. I just see 10 October maybe, and it arrived in normal. <laughs> Anyways, uh, cool place to ride, super rural. Looks like it might be a rice paddy in the background. Enjoy the ride. From street style t-shirts, I love this guy's post. Full of style, uh, please don't try this at home. Great, enjoy the baby maker. Please keep posting, I love seeing them. From Lodo Photos, Toronto, Ontario. 369 days later, my commuter bike arrived. Hashtag Lodo Photos, FLX, FLX bike, baby maker. Use all the hashtags. 
I love it. Sterling, baby maker, touring package, and I love to see the helmet. Thank you very much for posting. From Buckley's JS, Lincoln Park. First ride, baby maker. How much fun is this thing? Powerful, loving it. Thank you so much for posting. I love to see that. Finally, let's do the lower volume locations. So the rest of the world, pretty much status quo, virtually completely shipped, handful of special cases. Indonesia, Mr. Chris in Indonesia, you've been on every single live, so patient. The bike's been stuck in customs forever, but I've just received news that your bike has been released from customs. So we're waiting on tracking from that, from customs in Indonesia to your door. Once we get that tracking, we will put it in for you so you can track it to your door. So it's not there yet, but big progress, Chris. Thank you for the patience. More good news in Australia, New Zealand. All of the bikes have shipped out. They've left our production facility in LCLs for both Australia and New Zealand, two separate less than container load shipments. And that's all the rest of the bikes, the outstanding bikes for Australia, New Zealand. So excited to finally close those countries out. Super exciting. On that shipment are 14 baby makers, 132 touring packages and chargers as well. That's a wrap for Australia, New Zealand. The extra batteries, those will follow shortly. But as far as bikes, that is complete. So excited. Thank you guys for your patience for those to get there. That's it for the global status update. A few more photos from M. Curtis McCoy. And I got to chat with this guy on Instagram, by the way. He broke his leg in several places, just like mine, but 10 times worse. And now he's riding his baby maker. He's riding mountain bikes. Super cool to see. Great rehab tool. I'm gonna take some fun rides on my new FLX bike, Baby Maker Pro. And I like this thing more every time I ride it. Thank you for posting. Keep it up. From Harvey Sato, what a day to ride to Lincoln FLX bike, FLX Baby Maker. I love it. That's a great, great photo. Thank you so much. Please post more of those. We've got to see them. From B Howder 24. And by the way, if you don't play on Instagram as much as I do, this is a vertical four by five post, which is recommended to take up the most of the screen real estate when you scroll through the feed. So good job. I do the same with my photos. Got the berry baby maker, the tangerine baby maker. Can't see the caption because the photo is so big, but please keep posting. I love it. This one from Fixed On Bikes, and it's actually a bike shop, not an owner, but they worked on it. Nice e-bike, unusual name, the baby maker by FLX. Gates Belt Drive and Magura Hydraulics. Big thumbs up from the bike mechanic. They did a brake service on it. And that's what we hear from so many people that get to work on the bikes. They're super impressed with it. I love seeing it. So big thumbs up from a mechanic. Thank you for posting that. Thank you for the quality work and uh, keep it up. From Zen Zach, Lakewood Ranch, Florida. After a long anticipated wait, she is here. The FLX Bike Baby Maker Pro Blue Raspberry. Thanks for posting. Glad you finally got it. Hope it's been worth the wait. That brings us to the challenge section. It's been a pretty smooth couple of weeks here as we finally get to the end of this thing. The problems have become less and less. They're still out there. Few special cases and dropped labels that we're still working on from the last update where we would prepare a label, send it to FedEx, and then somehow that label just wouldn't make it onto a bike. So the logistics team, Troy especially, have been working on getting those righted. I think there's still a couple to go. And then the other shipping ex exceptions, it is an absolutely crazy time for shipping around the world. we got the same challenges going on with our sister company when we ship skateboards. One will go out halfway to the destination and then just kind of stop and come back and then we got to ship it a second time. So for an example, one bike we sent to Alaska, everything labeled completely correct for Alaska. Somehow the shipper brought it to Hawaii. So we're not getting that one to the correct person. If your bike has been victim of some weird handling, thank you for your patience. We will, we will get to the bottom of it. We will get that bike to you. It might just take a little bit of extra time to do it, but we will take care of it. So thank you for hanging tight while we deal with these shipping challenges. That's really it for the challenges though. We're so close to finishing this thing. Thank you everybody so much for your patience. I know it's taken quite a bit of time to build and ship all these bikes you've been more than generous with your time and understanding to get to this point i am so excited to see all your photos receiving the baby makers for the handful left we're almost there thanks again for the patience and we will be completing this very soon that's it for today's production update let's see a few more photos and wrap this thing up from decibel music daddy in pompano beach florida fun ride on the baby makers two modified baby makers got the uh 
stem extender on there. Super cool. From Rohi, that connoisseur with the tall photo. Berry Baby Maker, matte black as well. I love it. Nice use of helmets too. Way to stay safe. And this is the man, the myth, the legend himself, Mr. Paul Dieter. He backed our original Indiegogo campaign in 2016 when we first launched our bikes five years ago. He got a trail. He's had multiple FLX bikes since then, got one for his wife. Now he's on the F5 trail and uh, he went out trout fishing with this trail. He rides so many miles on these bikes. He's an absolute FLX legend. I got to stay at his house actually in Seattle. He tried out the original baby maker there. So Paul, I hope you're watching. Thank you so much for your long standing support and adv advocated for e-bikes around the world. Really appreciate it and enjoy the ride. Another cool post from W Mike Fawcett. Thank you to everyone who donated to our cause. We exceeded our goal by 111%. He's got a tricked out Baby Maker Pro Sterling. Check out those mirrors, super cool. And he was riding to fight kids cancer, super cool. The goal was to ride 500 miles. They raised more than they needed for kids cancer. Great cause. Thank you so much for sharing that, for tagging us. If you want to be featured in a future video or just shout it out on our Instagram page, please tag us. It's at flx.bike, tag us in the photo or use the hashtag flxbike so we can find your photos easily. Thank you so much everybody for sharing your photos, for your patience if you haven't received it yet or if you did receive it and it was later than expected. If you enjoyed this production update, please hit the subscribe button, the big thumbs up. We'll see you in the next one.